Yo, what is going on guys? It is LC Bronze here with some Pokemon Leaf Green. Oh man, Leaf Green. I'm actually doing a shiny hunt on Leaf Green right now. <sighs> I actually haven't played through this game in a long time. I have a lot of memories in this game. But anyway, let's get through this. I'm trying not I'm not gonna use the speed up button a lot. Like just to skip all this boring stuff. Like am I a boy? Yes, I am a boy. I keep forgetting the buttons are different on this. Then what I don't know what select is, so it looks like Oops. You have to get used to these buttons. Oh my god. Just like the worst at that. <laughs> Now we get it. Alright, if this video goes up before another video I'm posting, it's actually a Call of Duty video. Then, I hope you guys go check that out as well. But yeah, this is... Oh, I just named him G on accident. Who cares? Yeah, let's just name him G. But, I know I said I'm not going to be doing any more like series or anything, but... You know, I'm getting bored of not doing anything. So I think this would be fun. So, welcome to episode 1 of Pokemon Leaf Green. So yeah, I'm not going to be doing any challenges because I'm not very good at challenges. Just want to play through the game like how I like it. Yeah, let's use that. Hi, mommy. We should probably go talk to our mommy. To our mammy. Old boys leave home. G's house. That's the best name ever. G. Alright, I, I honestly don't know who I'm gonna get yet. Charmander is my favorite, but I always use Char Charmander, so I don't know. And I don't know if there's other Pokemon that I would like to use, like other fire types, grass types, water types. Hmm. I actually have a water type in mind. I don't have any grass or poison types in mind. But I also don't have any fires because I can't get um, Growlithe or Arcanine in this game. But I could get Ninetales. I guess let's just get Charmander. Alright. Yes, we're gonna give him a nickname. This is the name I get to give to all my dragon types, basically. But, you know, Charmizard is pretty much a dragon. Kratos. Kratos. Alright, so I'm gonna be adding Kratos to the layout, and. BRB! Alright, guys, we are back. And now, Kratos is on the layout. Got a cute little sprite there. Looking pretty chill. Chill, chill, chill. Alright. Let's see something here. Wait, no, I already changed the tech speed. Even though it doesn't really matter. Rival Jeep. <sighs> so if you guys are excited for this Let's Play, please subscribe, leave a like, and comment. It helps out the channel a lot. It helps me grow. Like I said, I'm I'm gonna be posting uh, MW3 Call of Duty video, so if you guys would check that out, it'd be greatly appreciated. I also have another one that I post today, a trick shot. If you guys like trick shots on Call of Duty? Then go check that out. All right. So I have a question of the day, or like a topic to talk about, and it is, who is your favorite starter? I actually, it's hard for me to decide. Charizard is probably like my favorite or one of my favorite Pokemon. So you would think Charmander would be my favorite starter. So that's not necessarily the case. I think he's like a really cool Pokemon and all. But like, I have to choose one from each generation. If that makes any sense. So, then let's just get started with this. So, basically, or you guys probably already know. Because I was just talking about it. From the Kanto, it is Charmander. 
like his evolutionary line, he's my hands down favorite. Second gen, it is Cyndaquil. Cyndaquil is just like a cute little motherfucker dude. And then third gen is Mudkip. Like, I kind of have a story behind Mudkip. Like, the first time I ever got Sapphire, I was like a little kid still. And it was like the first Pokemon game I bought by myself, like with my own money. And also, Swampert was the first Pokemon I ever got to level 100, so Mudkip has like a lot of like meaning to me, I guess. And from fourth generation, like the starter selection out of them, I don't really like that much. But I guess I would have to say Chimchar would be my favorite because Infernape's pretty cool. Do I have to talk to him? And then from fifth gen, Snivy. I love Snivy. He's like in my top three favorite starters. He's definitely up there. In sixth gen, this is like I'm actually gonna list them in row in a row of like my least favorite. And nobody get mad at me, please. My fr my favorite is Fennekin. Then Chespin, and then Froki. I just think Froki is like everybody likes Froki. Got to get Fennec in a chance, man. <sighs> that was a mouthful talk or to say. I'm just not used to it yet. Let's see here. If you guys didn't know this, there's a little potion back here. It always comes in handy. And we got our Pokeballs right. Because I'm thinking about catching somebody. Nope, not Mankey. I'd usually get a, a Nidoran male here. Because I, I just think he's one of the best Pokemon ever. Not one of the best Pokemon ever, but whenever I played the red version, like the original red, I would always get him. He could. I felt like he could just learn every move, but... This is our Pokemon. This is the one that I want. I guess we already, or we're gonna already have a flying type, but you know, a little early on flying. So yep, here we go with that Spiro. Okay, now I gotta think of a nickname. Hmm. You know what? I'll be back with him on the layout and his nickname in one minute. All right, guys. I got that name down. His name is gonna be Savage. Cause he's a savage little birdie. Alright, let's see here. Oops. Kratos, let's see. Alright. Alright guys, th I think I'm gonna- this is gonna be the end of today's video. Today's episode. Hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like. Comment, subscribe. And... Peace.